Only eight times have both of them been ranked, and two of those have come this year. This is number two at Chrysler Arena on Saturday night. Jared Sullinger looking to continue the six-game winning streak for the Buckeyes over the Wolverines. Trey Burke, his high school teammate, trying to end it. And early on, Buckeyes just couldn't buy a hoop. They were 0 for 9 from behind the arc in the first half. William Buford, in particular, struggling offensively in this game. Deshaun Thomas, who actually scored the ball pretty well, but not there. Again, 0 for 9 in the first half. Trey Burke, the jumper for the Wolverines. They led it by five at the half. Derek Sollinger and company trying to regroup in the locker room. Second half, Michigan up by four. Jordan Morgan off the feed from Burke. Morgan had a double-double, 11-11. -double, and 11. Another jam there. Michigan up by a half dozen. Sollinger struggling against Morgan. Here, Mike. They used a lot of Jordan Morgan on his own. Other teams had crowded him more lately. He got a few doubles Jared Sullinger had to face, but Jordan Morgan really stood up to Jared Sullinger well. Michigan up seven, Tim Hardaway Jr. He had 13, four of five from the field. Michigan up by 10. Deshaun Thomas, I mentioned how good he was. He had 25. The problem was the rest of the Buckeyes combined had 26. Michigan up by four, and then just a huge shot here by Zach Novak. So the Wolverines up by five. Next Buckeyes possession, it is Sullinger. He had to work for everything he got. 14 and eight for the big guy. Michigan still up by three, and Sullinger's high school teammate, Burke, kind of sealing the deal. Off glass, 17 points, five assists for the freshman. And Burke and Hardaway celebrate as Burke and Sullinger exchange pleasantries after the game. 56-51. The Wolverines do win it in a game in which Ohio State never led. They shot under 39% from the field, their second worst showing in a conference game this year, as Michigan held Ohio State without a single fast break point, and they do end that six-game skid against the Buckeyes. Here's Trey Burke now with our Sue Ann Roback. Thanks a lot here with Trey Burke. You guys stay unbeaten at home. You knock off the number six team in the country. How were you able to be so successful tonight? We just stuck together as a team. You know, that's what it came down to. The first game, you know, when they went on their runs, we kind of broke down and allowed them to punk us on the board. You know, we knew it was going to be a different team that y'all saw tonight. I don't know how Ohio fans feel, but Michigan fans are glad to have you. Is this win a little sweeter coming against your hometown team? Definitely. One of the best wins of my career, my career ever. You know, it's just good to beat them. You know, we still got work to do. We got some more games left in the Big Ten. Uh, so, you know, I'm just glad that we, we showed everyone that we could come together tonight. Um, you know, stick it out. Trey, you had a great game. Enjoy this one. Thank you. Guys, let's go back to you.